Hello, I'm Janine Perrett from Sky News, talking with Mark Henley, who's Director of Transformation and Digital Strategy for Adobe Pacific. Welcome, Mark. Hi, Janine. Mark, you talk about the rehumanisation of the workforce. What do humans bring to the workforce compared with technology? Creativity, passion for the work that they do, the ability to solve really complicated problems coming at it from different angles simultaneously. Technology is great. Technology has done amazing things for us as a species, and it's going to continue to do that. But humans have this kind of X factor. There's something still about humans working together and working in flow that is just unique. And I think the opportunity now is to move beyond uh, the previous ways of working which have put humans as sort of cogs in the machine and allow them to be a bit more creative in the workplace. You've also talked about the problem of leaving some employees behind. So what should organisations be thinking about in the transformation process to bring all employees along on this journey? Yeah, it's a really hard question. There's no easy answer that says there's a panacea that will fix every employee in every circumstance. But I think as a, uh, a sort of operating principle, if we treat people well and we assume that we will get the best rather than the worst from them as a starting point, and that we look at employee experience um, rather than employees as assets, you begin to get different behaviours. You get people that rise to the challenge rather than shrink from the fear of the problem. And there's a lot of nervousness, outright fear, about the disruption, about the changes that technology is bringing. But there's also plenty to be optimistic about. What are you optimistic about? Look, I think I'm optimistic about all the opportunities that technology brings. And history and humanity has shown that technology is an enabler throughout history, from kind of fire and cave paintings on forward. Um, we're at a point in history where many new technologies are coming together simultaneously, whether that's machine learning or virtual reality or autonomous vehicles or medical tech. And together there are some really startling new opportunities that will emerge from that, many of which we can't predict. So I think that um, it's likely that we're going to have um, really big breakthroughs. And what I hope is that humans will have a better experience of their daily lives. And we're already seeing that in a very small way. Our smartphones have brought all kinds of things to us in the last decade that we didn't used to do. Certainly there are some negative behaviors there, but the ability to communicate more quickly, the ability not to be lost in new cities, the ability to take photographs wherever you are, are genuinely useful. And I think that's a tip of the iceberg for what uh, really interesting tech could bring. Oh, well, on that positive note, thank you very much. Thank Mark you. Kimberley.